this beautiful lady these hickory sticks and hickory sticks was lovingly restored at one point by the Ivy family and then that's been about 60 years ago maybe 70 and Fran Ivy did a beautiful job now as you can tell this is a bit creepy back here I can't go up there because the gravel drives a bit worn and um, don't have permission for another not sure who owns it now the Howlands had it at one point and it's very haunted. This is where the Valentine's Ghost lives. It's a woman who comes down the staircase and on Valentine's Day in beautiful dress and then she kind of disappears. Yeah. Then there's supposedly an angry ghost up there. A man. Uh, and he's upstairs tromping around and making all kind of mayhem and he appears and he's very unsettling and uh has even run out a few of the residents who've lived there in the past. So, we'll try and find out more about that. But, uh, I'll see if I can talk to the family that lived here. Um, and maybe to Robert Ivy himself, who grew up in this house as a boy. As you can see, there's beautiful land all around. And we're right in a neighborhood in downtown Columbus. On 7th Avenue North. Sorry, 7th Street North. I get my avenues and streets mixed up. Always have, always will. Anyways, this is 7th Street North. Thank you for coming on my little tour of Columbus, Mississippi. And another creepy, haunted house hidden under all these beautiful oak and magnolia trees. Y'all make it a good day. Oh, and y'all, I think it's for sale if you want it. Buy you a haunted house. If I had the money, I would.